Some of you may or may not know, I've had a really unique opportunity over the past probably seven years. I've traveled literally all over the world. I've been to every chiropractic convention and event and seminar that you can imagine. And I've seen the best of what our profession has to offer. I've been doing this for about 25 years now. Uh, and I feel like I'm just starting to get the hang of it and really starting to get some uh, good understanding of what we do because things are changing, right? You heard of technology? I mean, it's growing all the time. So we really didn't know what was going on. But anyway, he found that bone racked out of place. He put his hands on Harvey's back and he racked the bone back into place. And guess what happened? Can hear Harvey's hearing came back. So we talked about patterns a little bit. What causes patterns? What plays into the patterns? There's a lot of little things. The number one thing is trauma. Has anyone ever had trauma? Yeah, you were born. Right? That's your first opportunity to have trauma. And we see that with a lot of babies. Okay? The birth process is pretty tough, aren't we? Or the Appalachian Trail. We see a little rushing in the bushes. We walk up there, what was that? <laughs> I don't know. Let's walk a little bit closer. Careful, because you don't know what it could be. We walk around the corner a little bit, and he sticks his head up. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bear. And if you see a bear in the parkway, <laughs> something's going to happen. Right? A warm... A warm hand is really a, a healthy thing, okay? And it's a little warm in the room, but those of you that have a nervous system that's really out of whack, you've got cold, clammy hands. It doesn't matter what the temperature is, okay? So that's something that we kind of keep in mind. That's normal. It's all a normal response. Okay? We adjust babies. We adjust people well into their 90s, okay? So it's gentle because we're changing the adaptability of the nervous system.